Hey guys, this is my unboxing of the Dream Mommy Skylar bedside bassinet. This is just a view of how it comes right out of the box, and this is what was inside that carry. I really appreciated how neat it was packaged and put together. It comes with a support bar that you see there. That is the bassinet itself, legs already attached. The bar is in the middle that's support to support um, the two legs, as you'll see. always read your instruction guys I'm just going to place the bed pad off to the side and begin by putting together that support bar As you can see, you want the side handles to kind of have that U-shape away from your body or away from the bassinet. Like I said, read your instructions. Um, quick review on this instructions. They were pretty clear. Um, on the first step, it was just mostly really looking at the picture versus what it actually said. You're actually viewing that support bar um, upside down at this point. I'm going to place that off to the side and undo the bassinet. So here I just want to show you how the legs are um, pretty loose. And those wheels in the front, they fold, but they don't um, stay folded. So every time you go to adjust those, they will pop right back into their position. And you can see how necessary that support bar really is. So the next step is to place the support bar. The bar is located in the back of the bassinet. And you'll want to for firmly press in the each side of the support bar. It was pretty difficult to uh, place this in. As you can see, I'm using the butt of my hand to hammer it in. On the bar, there is a little um, indention portion. Kind of looks like a circle. And then, of course, there's an opening on each leg. You know it's all the way in once that circle is completely filled with the gray um, notch that's in on the support bar itself. I do suggest if you have a small hammer or a light hand to use a hammer. I did have to um, hit that pretty hard to get it to go all the way in and make sure that the um, gray notch on the bar was fully into that hole. You know it's all the way in when that circle on each leg is fully gray. There's no um, gaps in between. So 
I did enjoy that the fabric piece was already on the bassinet. Next I'm going to place that support for the bottom and it inserts to each leg as well. And you should hear each side click in. Be sure to check. I thought that side was in and it wasn't. So you'll want to push firmly on both sides and then pull back to make sure it does not come out. There are five Velcro pieces. That piece there is kind of like a pocket, so you'll make sure that the uh, upper bar is inside that pocket and then attach the velcro pieces on the um, bar first after the loop so you have the um, u-shaped loop that makes up that shelf there and you want to attach it underneath on the first rack first row And that completes the setup of the Dream On Skylar Bedside Bassinet. Just making sure each one was actually clasped. Last step is to put the mattress pad in. did have to press pretty firmly to make sure that it was flat to the bottom and there are no gaps around the mattress. The front top of either side there's a zipper. This houses the clasp to drop the side down. You push outward on the clasp and lift up and that drops the flap down. This allows for easy access to your infant um, throughout the night and it goes butt up against the bed which you'll see here in a minute. I do want to know, I did see in the store that their display bassinet, the clips were broken. So just be sure to be gentle placing those ba areas back into their um, home. So here is what it looks like butt up against the bed. As you can see there is no space between my mattress and bassinet. The ropes that you saw hanging earlier they actually go under the mattress and on top of the box spring and fasten to the other side. This creates security 
um, that your bassinet won't get jostled and create a gap throughout the night. There is a ledge, if you can see the gray stars on that white edge, that um, is up high enough that your infant should not be able to roll out of the crib. Once the infant is pushing up, it is suggested that you no longer use the bassinet as it becomes a fall risk. The Dream on Skylar bedside bassinet is a perfect addition to the bedroom to keep infant close. I'm so excited to use this and I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Please subscribe, like, and comment down below.